Hi, my name is Malcolm and I'm a PSLE Science Specialist here at The Big Lab. Welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. In this video, I'll be going through a past year examination question on the topic of animal classification. I've also prepared this question for you to download for free by clicking a link in the description box below. So, let's get started. Question 5. We may observe four animals A, B, C and D. The table below records its observation and now they want us to find out which animal is a reptile. So to answer this question, let's take a look at the table. Now for the first question, they ask, does the reptile have scales? The answer is definitely yes, because all reptiles will have scales. Now since we know all reptiles have scales, which options are possible? We know that it can be option 1 or 3. And which options can we cross out? We can cross out options 2 and 4. Now that we are done with the first question, let's take a look at the next. Now the next question asks, does the reptile have a shell? Now think about this, are there reptiles with shells? Yes, what examples can you think of? One very good example is the turtle. But at the same time, are there also reptiles that do not have a shell? Definitely. What are some examples? Some examples are like the crocodile. What else? And the lizard. Which means for this second question, does it matter whether it's a yes or a no? No. So let's write it out. We know it can be either a yes or a no. It doesn't matter. Which means is option one still possible? Definitely. What about option three? Also possible. Lastly, let's take a look at the final question. Now they ask, does the body temperature of the reptile change with that of the surroundings? Now some of you might be wondering, what does this actually mean? Now I want you to think about this. We as humans, we are mammals. And you know mammals, are we warm-blooded or cold-blooded? We are warm-blooded. Now since we are warm-blooded, when we go into a winter country, we know that the winter country, is it very hot or very cold? It's going to be very, very cold. But if you were to take your temperature in that winter country, do you think your body temperature will change? No, in fact, your body temperature will remain the same. So that's what it means to be warm-blooded. When you are warm-blooded, it means will your body temperature change? No. Now, what's the opposite of warm-blooded? that will be cold-blooded. Now, if the animal is cold-blooded, if they move from a hot habitat to a cold habitat, this time, will their body temperature change? Answer is yes. So if we take a look at the reptile, reptiles, are they warm-blooded or cold-blooded? They are cold-blooded. And because they are cold-blooded, do you think their body temperature will change with that of the surroundings? Answer is Yes. Which means, is option one possible? Yes. What about number three? No, because they answered no. So with that, we can get our final answer. What should be the correct answer for question five? The answer should be number one. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to check out more videos by us, do click on the links on the right hand side. Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Thank you and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!